Hi, everyone. Um, I just wanted to jump on here and talk to you all for a few minutes. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys a um, six tips for having your wedding right now. I know uh, everything's really crazy with um, COVID and the coronavirus um, and all of that. But there's a lot of people still wanting to get married right now. Um, so I just wanted to give you six tips for doing that safely. So the first one is having hand sanitizing stations. Make sure that you have hand sanitizer everywhere. Um, if you can get some of the big bottles to set out or even just a ton of the small ones, that'd be super helpful um, and it helps keep everybody safe. Another thing you can do is having hand sanitizer as a wedding favor. I know it sounds like a little cliche right now, but I mean, everybody can use it. So um, I would highly recommend it. Um, another thing is making sure that there's masks available for guests. Even if it's just like the disposable ones, um, it still goes a long way and um, it's pretty inexpensive and it helps keep everybody safe. Another thing is to make sure that you guys have um, just some signs with friendly reminders for everybody. Um, you know, making sure that people are staying apart, that they're washing their hands, that everybody's using hand sanitizer, just like simple things that we're seeing everywhere right now, but like making cute signs that go with your decor um, can really go a long way in your wedding planning or in your wedding day too. Um, another, the fifth thing I have for you guys is um, to make sure that there's extra tables and outside space. So I know a lot of people have had, like they're having indoor wedding or they wanted to have indoor weddings, um, but unfortunately right now that's not the safest option. So making sure that there's extra tables so people can spread out if you do have to do it all inside. Um, but ideally there would be outside space too. So people can get out, spread out a little bit um, and still have a good time. Um, my last tip is to make sure that you have um, individually wrapped silverware and plated dinners. So a lot of people will do um, buffet, but unfortunately right now that's just not possible. Um, buffet lines are like can get contaminated with people breathing on the food. Um, if you are doing buffet line, a lot of um, caterers are like they do have the plexiglass up and are just passing plates down, uh, which is a great option. Um, but if you can do a plated option, that would be even better. Um, and like I said, making sure that the silverware is uh, wrapped individually and on the tables so people aren't accidentally touching each other's. So, um, and one bonus thing, um, if you have had to cut your guest list down, which a lot of you have, which is super unfortunate. But um, one thing you can do is thankfully technology is a great thing. Um, have somebody um, set up a tripod at the back of the church or ceremony location um, to live stream your wedding on Facebook or Zoom. Um, that way people can still watch it if they weren't able to come to your wedding. Um, so I hope you guys are all doing well and staying safe, but those are my six tips for you today. Bye guys.